So I just made a quick run to the camp store. Because <sighs> y'all know how I love Shen Mama's Dutch oven biscuits. She forgot her butter. So I made a run to the camp store. It was downhill all the way, which was awesome. Rode my bike. Here, see? See my, my bike? Rode my bike. It was awesome. Problem with being downhill all the way was it was uphill all the way back. After I paid $9.71 for four bars of butter. This better be the best butter ever. Heavy. So the trick is to put about a third as many briquettes underneath it because you have to heat the air between the lid and the top of the biscuits. But the ones on the bottom are in contact with the biscuits, so it doesn't take near as many. So I'm gonna move this out. Up. Some out there. Now you wanna spread them out good, because we kinda got in a deal last time where we had too many in the center, and the center got a little too done. Doesn't take very many, does it? No. Matter of fact, I've probably got, yeah, I've got a few too many. I need to take some of these back out. to put these back up under there because it's not in direct contact with it but these are pretty hot on top so all right and now we wait now we wait it'll take about what same amount of time as it does in the oven about 15 minutes maybe yeah time for sausage we start checking them in about 15. Okay. Sometimes it starts to rain again and you have to improvise to keep your charcoal from getting wet. <laughs> hey baby. little waves of rain coming through every once in a while but most of it right now is just when the wind blows as you hear it doing now uh the water falling off of the trees but shannon and i are kind of stuck back up here in the uh, let's see i think this is the northeast corner of the campground and we really don't even have any neighbors now well, we've got a car driving through right now but as you see way down there, that camper right there, I mean, he's about 60 yards from us. Then our next nearest neighbor is up and on around. Yeah, it looks, they think I'm filming them. I'm really not. I'm really wishing they would go on. So they're I'll pan. Down, so yeah, they're slowing down so I can get a good picture. Um, See, we don't have anyone in this spot. Um, then the road curves around, and our next.
closest is way down this hill right here. Um, actually, probably our closest is this little scamp camper right here. And he's probably 60 yards as well. So we're kind of stuck up here in the corner by ourselves, which is kind of nice. We have an occasional car drive through, but not, not very many. All right, so tell me what you're doing there, Shannon. Well, I made a sausage and I, the grease that was left over, I dabbed it up with a paper towel, but I left the sausage bits in there and I just threw the, the butter in there and I'm scraping it. I think they call it deglazing on the Food Network and deglazing the pan, pan with butter. So I'm making sausage butter to go on top of the biscuits. Oh, Jesus, Jesus. Not a, not healthy. This is not a healthy food channel. This is, we've been eating healthy, so this is our camping splurge. Now, this is gonna be a little more difficult because we had to rig us up a little cover because it was raining and charcoal was getting rained on. You have to be really careful because of the wind, it will blow ashes. Perfecto. Um, I guess we need to look at the bottom though. Don't. Oh, those are perfect. Perfect. Time for the butter. You want to go get it? Sure. I'm gonna pull this off the bottom though before. It... Oh yeah. Well, you can just carry carry it over there. Hurry, you wanna get wet? Okay. We didn't bring a little thing to put them on, did we? No. That little thing to put them on. What do you mean? Set it up here like a top holder or anything. I just brought a towel. Um, you ready for me to pour down? Ready to pour down. Again, I'm not healthy. And that has no bacon grease, just ba uh, sausage grease, just sausage bits. <laughs> I know people probably think that we're weird, but this rain has not hampered our camping in the least. Matter of fact, we, we really enjoy the rain. Um, I don't know, it just adds, adds something to it. Uh, it's no, the temperature is just about as perfect as it can be. I've got a sweatshirt on, a hoodie but I really don't even need that. Um, this, is, this has been nice. So far, this has been really nice. Now, it's supposed to get a lot cooler tonight. We'll see. Okay, pick her up. Perfect. Which one you want now? The perfect Dutch oven biscuits. It, it, it doesn't matter, that one's fine. Here, let me come in. I'll get it from this side. I think it'd be. Oop. That one tore apart. No, that's yeah, fine. There we go. All right. But I am going to get my little piece that came off there. Sausage and strawberry preserves. Oh, my goodness. So we're having these biscuits. Homemade strawberry jam. Mm -hmm. Zilly mornings. The lid with the charcoal can also serve as a little personal space heater, right, Shannon? Mm -hmm. It's actually amazing how much heat is coming off of that thing. Major. 